I'm not one of those guys who's going to tell you that it's no dice if it doesn't have a stick shift. Yet there are definitely some cars out there whose flavor is vastly intensified when ordered with a manual transmission. And this 2015 Civic Coupe is certainly one of them. It's been a mere nine months since my previous Civic Coupe test drive, that of a significantly upgraded 2014 model that impressed in a variety of areas. That car introduced a new continuously variable transmission among a host of other changes. This time around, I've got the same car, a Civic Coupe EX, but with one key difference, the standard five-speed manual. Though the CVT is a good one and returns two MPG better, a frisky coupe and a stick shift go hand in hand. And besides, it saves you $800 at purchase. Following consecutive years of big changes, the 2015 model carries over unchanged. This EX trim stickers for a reasonable 21,210, and like most Hondas, has a non-existent options column. So what you see is exactly what you get for that price, which includes items like smart entry and push button start, myriad ways to connect and play music, with the notable exception of satellite radio, a touchscreen infotainment system absent navigation, and lane watch to see what's happening on the right side of the car. They're easy to buy because you needn't fuss over add-ons, but that also means that the ability to personalize and have standout features are minimal. Honda's very good at making things simple, and the Civic Coupe has that get-in-and-go, unencumbered personality that owners love. Well, that's mostly true, as the new touchscreen will leave you wanting for a few knobs and buttons, but most of the action can be controlled through steering wheel switches. Now in year two, the Civic Coupe's newfound vitality can be seen in its appealing, sporty design, which looks great in rally red with the standard 16-inch wheels. At only 2,800 pounds, the 1.8-liter single overhead cam iVTEC engine plays lively with a 6,700 RPM redline to pursue its 143 horsepower. It's not fast per se, but this four-cylinder is a honed piece of Honda craftsmanship that's flexible, refined, and willing to give you everything it's got. But the piece de resistance is undoubtedly the stick, which provides fluid, slickly engineered gear engagement with an easy to modulate clutch pedal. The clutch and shifter combo in this car is excellent, pleasing both the novice and experienced driver. I've had way more fun driving the Civic Coupe this week than I ever would have thought. It always feels light on its feet, eager to run, with remarkably connected steering and just enough engine to keep it interesting. The Civic Coupe has its own suspension tune for sportier driving and thus provides a combination of soft, everyday comfort with a bit more bite for the driver who wants a little more. Unfortunately, the Hankook Optimo tires want little to do with such spirited driving and exacerbate this car's propensity to understeer. Look for cars on the lot with grippier Conti Pro Contacts instead. A little more sound deadening would be cool too. Gas mileage is rated at 28 MPG City, 36 Highway. The Civic Coupe is an inexpensive, easily tunable, well-rounded offering that fits your everyday comfort needs in a segment with few choices and even fewer with stick shift fun. For TestDriveNow.com, I'm Steve Hammes.